Okay, folks, we're going to start the health committee hearing. Good morning, everyone. I am Mark Levine, Chair of the City Council's Health Committee. Welcome to our hearing this morning. Pleased that we are joined by fellow Health Committee members, Council Member Alika Amprey Powers, Council Member Brooks, Council Member Dr. Eugene, Council Member Holden, um, and uh, also Council Member uh, Keith Powers, who I believe is a member of our committee. Did I miss any other committee members? I think we got it. Um, ah, Council Member Diaz as well, hiding in the back. Um, folks, we're going to make this quick. If I can just have a little bit of quiet in the chamber, please. Today we're going to be hearing, and we're, today we're going to be holding an important vote on proposed intro. 2373A by Councilmember Rafael Salamanca, which amends the administrative code of the City of New York in relation to amending a transcript of a record of death caused by COVID-19. The bill would require the Department of Health and Mental Hygiene to waive any fee for applicants requesting to amend a death certificate to list the cause of death as COVID-19 or health complications caused by COVID-19. Ordinarily, under the city's health code, DOHMH charges a non-refundable $40 processing fee to correct most death certificates. Throughout the COVID-19 pandemic, there has been a backlog at funeral homes, hospitals, and at the city's office of the chief medical examiner, which has resulted in some death certificates needing to be changed to include COVID-19 as the cause of death. And this has ended up imposing yet another burden on people suffering in this pandemic. Folks who in many cases need the cause of death accurately listed on their loved one's death certificate to get FEMA assistance for burial and other purposes. So uh, I, I want to thank Councilmember Salamanca for leading and pushing this bill forward. And I want to thank the staff of the Health Committee for helping to make this possible. Councils Harbani Ahuja and Sara Liss, Policy Analyst M. Balkan, and Finance Analyst Lauren Hunt for their work in preparing this legislation. I would now like to cue our colleague, Councilmember Salamanca, for a few remarks on his bill, please. Thank you, uh, thank you Mr. Chair, um, um, and I want to thank the, the Health Committee. Uh, like thousands and thousands of New Yorkers, um, in April of 2020, I lost my dad to COVID-19. Uh, and when I received his, uh, his death certificate, uh, I realized that under um, reason for, for death, it was natural causes. Um, I really didn't pay any mind to it until the federal government, uh, FEMA, has an assistance where individuals can apply uh, to get some reimbursement for funeral expenses. And I was getting calls from constituents who were uh, dealing with the same issue where their death certificate just said natural causes. And so as a result, FEMA was just not approving their application. Uh, so I think that this goes a real long way. When I looked into um, fixing my dad, correcting my dad's death certificate, uh, there was a $40, $40 fee. Um, you know, I, I am blessed that I can be able to afford it, but there are hundreds and hundreds of New Yorkers uh, which a $40 fee is a burden on them. And many of them may forego fixing their family member's death certificate just because they don't have the $40. Uh, so I really want to thank uh, the Health uh, Committee Council and, and you, Mr. Chair, for uh, helping me push this bill through. Thank you, Councilmember Salamanca. And we, we <laughs> grieve with your loss and admire how you've turned it into something positive for our city. So thank you, sir. And now I'd like to cue the committee, council, committee clerk to call the vote. Matthew DiStefano, Committee Clerk, Committee on Health, roll call vote on proposed intro 2373A. Chair Levine. I vote aye. Eugene. I vote aye. Barron. Uh, very important bill, and I vote aye. Ampre Samuel. I vote aye. Holden. I vote aye. Powers. 
All right, Councilmember Powers votes aye. Dharma Diaz. Aye. Councilmember Dharma Diaz votes aye. Brooks Powers. I vote aye. A vote of eight in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions. The item has been adopted. Thank you. Congratulations, Councilmember Salamanca. And this will conclude our hearing. Thank you so much.